Have you ever wondered why the Atlantic and Pacific Oceans don't mix? It's a fascinating phenomenon that can be explained by a few key factors. First, let's talk about the difference in water density. The Atlantic Ocean is saltier and colder than the Pacific Ocean, which makes it denser. This difference in density creates a barrier that prevents the two oceans from mixing easily. Another factor is the Coriolis effect. This is the apparent deflection of moving objects caused by the rotation of the Earth. In the Northern Hemisphere, the Coriolis effect causes the surface currents in the Atlantic Ocean to move in a clockwise direction while in the Pacific Ocean they move counterclockwise. These opposing currents further contribute to the separation of the two oceans. Additionally, there are underwater mountain ranges and ridges that act as physical barriers between the Atlantic and Pacific Oceans. These features disrupt the flow of water and create boundaries that prevent mixing. It's important to note that while the Atlantic and Pacific Oceans don't mix on a large scale, there are areas where they do interact. For example, the Gulf Stream in the Atlantic Ocean can influence the climate of the eastern coast of the United States, and the Pacific Ocean can have an impact on the weather patterns of the western coast of North America. In conclusion, the Atlantic and Pacific Oceans don't mix due to differences in water density, the Coriolis effect, and physical barriers. This separation creates unique ecosystems and weather patterns in each ocean, making them distinct and fascinating in their own ways.